Good, insert your time of day here. This is Siltus. I just thought I'd do a quick tutorial on a neat little thing I found with the Vive. Essentially what I found is that you can use the Xbox streaming to your Windows 10 computer to eliminate some of the problems with FPS when playing 2D games in the Vive on things such as big screen beta. When running this on a 970 as opposed to a 1080 this allows you to have greater fidelity without having to worry about losing too much FPS as long as your internet can handle it or if you have a wired connection to your Xbox. Now the first thing you're going to want to do is open up the Xbox app. I just go onto the start menu here, type in Xbox and click it. When this loads up you'll want to click add a device which will allow you to Choose whatever Xbox is already on your network, it must be switched on before you start, and click connect. Once you're connected to your Xbox, what you want to do is click on the stream button in the top right. This will load up the um, stream from the Xbox, and then you'll want to go ahead and start big screen beta, or a similar program. You can customise your settings as much as you want, like you usually would. You'll probably want to go with one of the environments that have a little green leaf, which means they are less GPU intensive. And then you'll want to load into that, put your Vive on and get started. So as you can see it allows you to play games that are usually Xbox exclusive on your PC, through the Vive on a giant screen in front of you, which personally I find very enjoyable. Now depending on your internet connection you might get the odd bit of stutter or frame rate drop uh, during gameplay but it's nowhere near as bad as it would be if you were playing a game whilst also trying to use your Vive. This technique in theory can also be used when using multiple computers and streaming a Steam game from one computer to the computer which has the Vive, offloading a lot of the GPU process and making it so that you can get great frames per second without having to have a beast of a computer. With the wealth of the games that are on the Xbox, you can play retro games, you can play football games, racing games, first person shooters, all through your Vive on a giant screen in front of you. You can even use it to watch movies or TV shows through different apps such as Crunchyroll, Amazon Prime, Netflix through the Xbox. So there we have the basic way to connect your PC and your Xbox together, allowing you to play Xbox games into your Vive. I hope you found this helpful. If you have, please feel free to like and subscribe. I'm planning on doing a bit more Vive content in the future, as well as continuing my normal Star Citizen content. Thank you once again for watching, and I hope you enjoyed it.